Arth actually wins this matchup. So, I don't know. We'll see, man. Definitely, this matchup definitely of, of oh. oh my god. And then he, 77 for a second. And then Tipper, okay. And then, yeah. Is that huh? a it, uh, it didn't sound like a Tipper, but it looked like a Tipper. I don't know. I don't know. Is there like a medium Tipper? I don't know. <laughs> I guess, I, you know. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. Oh wow, that little dash back was so good. Micro spacing. Micro spacing for sure. We're seeing a lot of Rainex abusing, um, abusing new players' wow, tendencies. Wow, okay, that was a tipper. Yeah, that was definitely a tipper. Yeah, he's abusing these players' tendencies to shield grab when it's not actually guaranteed. Exactly, that's a really bad habit, and it doesn't work on players of certain caliber. Oh my goodness, that. Oh. At twenty-eight <laughs> percent. My goodness. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Speaking of caliber. Speaking of caliber. Four socks and one. Yeah. Jeez. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, this this match is really tricky for both characters because like it's a lot of a neutral game. Who wins the neutral game? Because the punish game is hard on both sides. Yes. So like all the little micro spacing things really help out here, mm -hmm. and especially when you're against a, like a seasoned player like Rainex, he definitely knows how to maneuver and have better control of his character. That's right. Which is very hard. Yeah. yeah. And he's uh he's generally gonna punish harder too, as yeah. we're seeing. Like right there. He's able to like DI so he lands on the platform, gets his shield up. That's kinda one thing that changed a lot about this matchup too, is is you know, back in the day Mars would all just DI in all day. Yeah. And she could just combo and combo and combo. But yeah. now, you know, people are learning how to DI better. Or I should say more people are learning how to DI better. Yeah. Nice little dash attack that barely barely reached. Yep. Very scary. Oh, Ooh. little chic tricks. Yep. I can do that one. Anyway. <laughs> nice. Oh wow, he tried to steal ledge from her. Yeah. From him. The ledge tricks on ledge tricks. Is he gonna get the ledge? Or oh, okay. oh, okay. I don't know what that was. I think so that's, that's it. That's it. No jump. No jump from the chic. Yeah. Chic. Well, I guess both of these characters, if they're off stage and they don't no have their jump, jump yeah. it's so free. Marth can just like swing up the stage and do whatever he wants. He can tip her, he can up B. Um, is that Ricita right there, by the way, watching this match? I think so. Okay, Ricita put on a very good show versus Momochi earlier. It's Street Fighter, commonly thought to be the best player in the world at this point. And uh, I guess he's supporting his boy, Rainex. I think they're friends. Rainex is also like yeah, a very like a seasoned Street Fighter, player. Street Fighter KOF, yeah. Just, uh, oh my ooh. goodness, no. So unfortunate. Also, he's 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 a uh, back on Fox as main, yes. so I don't know. Maybe he made his point. Yeah. I can beat you with Marth. Uh, now have a taste of my main character. Yes. Paradoxically, this is going better for Puke. Oh. Uh, is that his name? Is his name Puke? Puke. That's yeah, that's an interesting. Oh, nice, Edgar. That was good. But yes, okay. Okay. Puke doing a little bit better against the Fox. As we can see, oh, we could have grabbed that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that could have been a Gibbs setup for sure. Let's see. Up throw, yep, he DIs onto the platform. Very important against Fox is like knowing uh, knowing how to make it difficult for, for Fox to do his combos, yeah. yeah. Even on things like uh, like like DIing the up throw, if you can DI to the top platform and tech on it, it makes it so much more difficult for him to get that, you know, up throw up air or whatever setup he wants. Ooh, that was nice. He did the Little Mermaid where he came down with an aerial. <laughs> that's, a little uh, that, that's like a really bad habit that even I have to fight a lot against sometimes. That I want to come down and hit them with an aerial, but it's really bad position for Sheik. You should really just try to get to the ledge and out of harm's way and come back and reset, reset to neutral, basically. Yeah. With Sheik especially, just because her like aerial mobility isn't as good as a yeah. character like... I don't know. Even Marth. But you just want to hit them, you know? You just want to, like, get them off of you, mm -hmm. throw out an air or something, but usually it doesn't work the way you want it to. Right. Nice. I gotta say, Puke is looking a fair bit better this match. Forward air? Oh! oh. I think that was supposed to be a forward air. Yeah. It's a common, a common oh, like, thing you see. Well. Like, you, you do the wrong aerial by accident because you flick the C-stick the wrong way. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's better. That's, that's better. better. Nice. Okay. A lot better here mm -hmm. versus the Fox. Oh, I knew he was going to roll in. Yeah. You got to roll in. Such a common, yeah, such a ver yeah, very yeah. common trap. You got to like, roll in. It's like a very bread and butter sort of counterplay. You know, you like yeah. run up like, hey, and then they want to get out of the corner, and then you just wave dash back, do whatever yeah. you want. He didn't even wait. Like, he just waited. Mm-hmm. Because he knows. 
Oh, we got the instant replay. Ooh, this was such a good combo here. And he lands. Yup, he knows. Oh, exactly. He knows. He knows. How did you know? Oh, wait, we got Six God Nightmare again. Six God Nightmare? What was the tag he was wearing earlier? Fancy. Fancy, okay. Because he thinks he's fancy. Is Yesterday he? he was wearing a shirt that had his own name on it. It was like a Marth and it says Nightmare. I saw that. You know, it he wasn't... He always feels himself. He does. I actually asked him about that shirt because we were playing like... For, we played Friendly's for like an hour. And um, apparently that's not Marth. That's uh, Kirito from Sword Art Online. Oh. So... Okay. Okay. The Black Swordsman Nightmare. <laughs> but we both... Uh, we had.